What's up guys, I'm Lost One Gamer here and welcome to a brand new game called Salix. Yep, that was me when this series began over a year ago now. I think it's fair to say that both this series and I have come a long way since then. The series began with a young Lysander Landberg with a few thousand gold to his name and the dream. Along with myself not having much of a clue as to what I was doing. <laughs> hey. Church bells ringing. They want me to go pray. Should I go pray to the good Lord? And thank him for my business endeavors? Maybe I should. Where's the church? I shall go there immediately. I shall thank him for my... Yeah, there we go. I shall go and pray. I shall thank him for everything that he has given me thus far. Although, literally, he's given me debt. <laughs> he's given me debt. <laughs> I guess you could say... That latter part is still somewhat true. Back then, things were not as smooth sailing and as easy as they would become. Buying an ale house with no real clue how to run it wasn't exactly the best idea in the world, and I was forced to close it multiple times. Lysander, for a time, became some weird entertainer that sells fruits and vegetables to make ends meet. Early on, however, Lysander met the love of his life, Aldretta. There she is, 26. Well... Is that a different person, isn't it? Let's let's talk to her real quick. Let's let's chat with her. Maybe she will take an interest in us. We have a fifty relationship with her right now. Well, it's fifty two you now. The two would eventually go on to get married and have two kids. Florence social class or some Oh my god. That scared the crap out of me. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, I'm supposed to be excited, but I was scared as frick. <laughs> Eldretta is giving birth to a baby girl. What is the name of this new child? Eldretta the <laughs> second. No, Bat Bout Bald Garda. No, Susan. <laughs> oh no. What is the name that would fit these times? My guy's name is what? Freaking Lysander. Um, Florence. Her name is going to be Florence. She's going to be old school Florence, okay? It's in Jedediah. The uh, more pages. Oh, God. Every freaking time. Every time it scares the life out of me. I, <laughs> I wasn't expecting this at this point either because it's still autumn, right? All right, well, we got our boy. So, Aldretta gave birth to a baby boy. So, what are we going to name him? Lysander II? <laughs> Lysander the second. How would I do that in this game? Lysander, should I just call him Lysander the second? No, we gotta call him something else. You know, I've always thought this was a cool name. I'm probably spelling it wrong, but uh, Jedediah. Then no, that's not how you spell that freaking name. Jed Jedediah. Jed did die. Jed da 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 da. I spelled it Jedidiah. Uh, that's how you know I'm a Star Wars fan. Not, not really enough to be like super crazy. But Jedediah? Is that how you spell it? That's gonna be how it's freaking spelled. I don't care. You know what it means, Jedediah. Through it all, she was the rock that kept him going, and the children were a hope for a better future in this dark middle age world. Though there were struggles. There was always hints that something great would end up happening with the Landberg family business. I guess those hints led to times like this. Oh no. Somebody set the alehouse on fire. Why? Why? And I can't do anything about it. I can't even get my guy over there. And of course, autosave. <laughs> and this. What is my cart doing? Wait. Crime. No! My cart was ambushed and ransacked. No! And this. What? The herbalist hut is on fire? It's on. Who burned down my herbalist hut? Excuse you. This is what they want to do to me now, right? Because I have all the gold, I have all the money, they want to try and run me out of town? That's not how this works. I will not be intimidated. Alright, people have burned down my buildings in the past, but listen, doesn't affect me at all. I mean, I have plenty of gold to be able to fix this, so uh, 
You think you're gonna get me out of town? It's not gonna work. Where there were those who wished to stop our expansion. As you can see, they failed. And the road ahead became bright and prosperous. Then things changed in the series forever. Although patient. Oh! <gasps> no! You're kidding! I. Hmm. I. Ah. Uh... I almost shed a tear there. I I'm shocked legitimately because I I was joking about it and I didn't think it was actually gonna happen and it freaking happened. Aldreda will pick up the role as head of the f Lysander is now ready to be sent into the afterlife. A funeral will be held soon. You will be able to visit their grave at any time. I j Oh boy, that... Mm. The death of Lysander, however, was not the end. Aldreda would take the torch and continue to run with it till the very end. She continued to grow the business empire larger than Lysander could have dreamed. An empire so large that there was barely anything that came in and out of Norbury and Leestead without the Landberg name stamped across it. I guess you could say we established one of the first corporations, and we did it through perseverance, patience, and surprisingly never breaking the law to get what we wanted. I must say that this isn't exactly the ending that I wanted for the series. In an ideal world, I would have liked for the children to take over the family business, or to be able to help the next generation of business owners like Red Wither, but nonetheless, I am proud of how far the series and I have come since the beginning. At least I can say that the sun never truly set on what we built. I would like to thank you all for your support throughout this series, which became one of the biggest on my channel. It means a lot to see that even after a year, this series still brought entertainment and joy to someone. Thank you guys for watching, and farewell, Salik.